Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Elizabeth from Elizabeth ASMR and the Eating Show. And today we are back with another requested video. This time I am doing tamales. Now these three right here, they are mixed. They have chicken and pork in it. And these over here are pork and there's only two of these i hope i can finish them all they're five tamales but i'm not sure if i'm gonna be able to i used to be able to eat like six or seven of them when i was younger but now i've tried and i can't but i'm hungry so we'll see but let's do our shout outs for this video five shout outs long list <laughs> okay first shout out mona lisa shout out to you bts trash shout out to you nidia cabrera shout out to you the lucas 99 shout out to you and George Fox, shout out to you. If I didn't get to your shout out in this video, I will get to, I don't know, five more next video. But just have patience. I will get to yours because, like I always say, I have a long list of shout outs and a very long list of food requests. But those are it for this video and I might do one more video after this okay let's get started <laughs> let's open these up these are corn husks and what these I bought from my sister I do not I mean I do know how to make them but I don't have the patience to make these they are pretty hard for me but um yeah what she I think what she does is she obviously she cooks the meat and seasons it and whatever and um seasons the the masa dough and she has to um soak the corn husks in water and like I think she does it in a little bit of hot water or something. And uh, and then she she cooks the the meat and she seasons it, she mixes it and everything. And then she puts some masa dough in one of these um corn husks. And and then she stuffs it. She puts meat in the middle and then she like kind of folds it and then folds it again and then tucks in the, one of the ends of the husk and then she puts them like in a big like pot or something and she boils them kind of boils and steams well actually it steams she steams them she puts water in the bottom but she doesn't fill it up of water and they just steam there for like, I think, 30 minutes to an, to an hour, I think. Uh, or until the masa is cooked. And she kind of takes one out, tastes it. And if the masa is done, then she'll uh, stop cooking it because they're done. But yeah, they are very good. Um, if you guys have never tried tamales before, you guys should. You guys do not know what you're missing. They are not. I don't think they are, um, what's it called? Keto? Keto diet friendly? They're not even any kind of diet friendly. They're very fattening. But they're very delicious. And... If you eat them once in a great big while, I mean, nothing's going to happen to you. 
But this is green salsa. And I'm going to add some to my tamales. Load them because this green salsa, it is spicy, but not too bad, I don't think. I hope. But, oh well. I like it with salsa. I'm Mexican. Um, I'm Hispanic. Mexican-American. Native. Whatever. I'm from all over the world, I guess. And, um, oh, sorry about that, guys. I'm on my table and it's a little bit wobbly. Because it's not stable. But anyways. Yeah, I like my food with some spice. When I couldn't eat spicy food, I was kind of mad at <laughs> myself. But, yeah, my mouth is watering, so let's get started. I'll give you guys the first bite of the mixed, uh, mixed meat. Pork meat and chicken. No, yeah, pork meat and chicken um, in the tamal. So here's your guys' first bite. Whoops, it's dripping. Okay. It dripped. <laughs> it's okay. All right. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my God. They are very good. The sauce is a little bit spicy, but not too bad. But they are so good, guys. I haven't had tamales in a very long time. Mm. The salsa is a little bit salty. But then again, I bought it. I didn't make it. Mm. They're so good. <laughs> mm, spicy. Well, <laughs> that was my dog. Mm. Water. Ah. <laughs> Water to drink. Little bit spicy. Okay, let's try the pork one. So these two over here. And I'll give you guys the first bite of the pork one. Here you guys go. I can taste the difference between the pork and the mix. This one, of course, it's pork. It's a lot more pork flavored than this one. And the, the masa dough, you don't only add water to it. You add a lot of things to it. You add, I think it's lard, I think. I don't know. But I think it's lard. And then you add like the chicken broth or the pork broth. And then you add some kind of coloring to it. So it can be this color and not pale. Ooh, spicy. 
But yeah, it's a lot of work, guys. To make the tamales, it's a lot of work. I would think it's like a whole day process. Unless you wake up like at 4 or 5 in the morning, then it's a half a day process. But, yeah. It takes a while. But you can make a whole bunch of them. And then you can freeze them. Like, frozen. Or, not frozen. Frozen, freeze them. It's the same thing. Um, raw. You can freeze them raw. And then you you take them out. And I think... I think my sister let, uh, does that. And she lets them thaw. And then she cooks them. But... I don't know what she does. What I... What I used to do when I used to make them is that I just make them and cook them all at the same time because I wouldn't make a lot. Mm. Out of these two, the pork and the mix, I would say the mixed one is my favorite. And I still have my glasses on. My hobby's right there. <laughs> He's right there. He's eating too, so. Yeah. He's right here. Right here. Oh, hi. <laughs> That's my hubby's hand. It's a work in progress, guys. I'm trying not to put him in into this. BS because a lot of people say mean comments to me and stuff and I don't want him to get involved. I don't want <clears throat> people to say mean things about him. Um, you guys always tell me F the haters, you know, don't listen to them, whatever. But when it comes to when it comes to me, I really don't care what they say. Uh, but when it comes to my husband or any of my family, oh, God, mm -mm. don't say anything about them because that's when I probably will say things that I shouldn't say. So I don't know if I want to bring him into my mess. But we'll see. We're, we're thinking about it. He he says yes. He wants to. But I say I don't know if I want to bring him into, into this. Mm. That's so good. Oh my God. So how has your Saturday been, guys? Let me know down in the comments. <clears throat> what have you done? Have you gone out? Where, where, um, like, what's your weather like? And if it's nice outside, are you grilling out? Or what are you doing?
who left. I don't know if you guys can see the meat right there. Pork meat. Spicy but good. You know what I like, guys? The tamales, the next day, I'm going to take this off. <laughs> The next day, I um, <clears throat> I like to um, warm them up on the stove. I like to warm them up on the stove with the husk so they won't burn. And um, like on a, I think, it, I don't know what it's called in English, but in Spanish it's called a comal. It's just the square thing that you warm up your tortillas in. Um, oh, excuse me. I like to warm them up there and then make myself or, you know, make a coffee and eat them, like put salsa on it and eat them. And then the heat, like the spice. And then you drink coffee and it, it, like with the heat of the coffee, the spice gets more intense and I love that feeling. <laughs> I don't know why. Hopefully, you guys know what I'm talking about. And I'm pretty sure my Hispanics out there know what I'm talking about. Hispanics, Mexicans, you know. Last bite of the pork one. Yum. <laughs> Last bite of the mix. Oh. 
Oh, that was so good. <clears throat> okay, as you can see, I did finish the five tamales. Maybe because I was hungry because I only ate one slice of pizza this morning. And like a couple of cookies and the, 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 that was it. Okay, guys, <clears throat> if you liked my video, please give me a thumbs up, comment in the comment section. Whew. And if you haven't subscribed already, please consider subscribing and click on the notification bell so you won't miss any future videos I post. Bye.